Hi, thank you very much for your interest about our new training course Database Design and Management. What is this training course about? Let's talk about database first. Database is an integral part of any information system today. A well-decided database can significantly boost the performance of the database and then improve the performance of the system overall. In this training, we will show you how to decide a database visually with entity relationship diagrams. Who will be benefit from this training? If you are a database engineer, in this training, you will learn how to master a professional database design tool visual paradigm to decide the database. If you are a developer, you will learn how to use the OLM, the Object Relational Mapping and the Hibernate in developing information system. Let's outline what we have this course. We will have four sections and 14 lectures. I just brief about each lecture and then you will enjoy the training course later on. In lecture one, we will talk about the entity relationship diagram, give some brief introduction. And then we will walk through what is entity and column. After that, we will talk about the entity in detail, how to set the detailed uh, properties of the entity and then the columns in detail. We will also cover the concept of different layer, different level of the entity relationship diagram. You can use logical, conceptual, and physical. Um, after that, the key and relationship will be covered. The database view is also a very important concept in database design and also database um, administrations. The trigger and store the procedure will also cover. In section two, we will talk about the database engineering. We will talk about how to generate the call and generate the database. Um, how to patch the database. You can patch the database from the old version to the new version and the visual paradigm will help you to generate such patch. And the reverse database to ERD helps you to bring a legacy database into a graphical form that you can continue to maintain and develop on. The first section will talk about the Java database programming, about the Hibernate, how to generate the Hibernate code and use it to develop your information system. The section four we are called best practice. We will suggest an approach to design and develop the database. And we will tell you how to generate the up-to-date data specification without effort. Hope you enjoyed this training course.